I feel like I've got my life back. Mark and Jane are hitting the slopes at Winter Park once again. It's huge for both of us, I think. Just that, that sense of freedom you get is unbeatable. Freedom to race and glide and fly. <laughs> It feels free to be out here and breathing the fresh air and getting to getting to go real fast down a mountain. There's nothing better than that. Just a month ago, this reality was uncertain. It definitely was the one of the lowest lows. Their car with their customized monoskis inside was stolen. We were pretty worried that we weren't going to get to ski. The specialized skis cost $15,000 each and months of work. If you have to buy this whole setup all at once, it's just a crazy amount of money and that we were not in a position to do that. Stuck at the base of the mountain, unable to ski, unable to teach at the National Sports Center for the Disabled. They know how much we love volunteering and it's such a tight community up here. But Denver 7 viewers were not about to let them sit out the rest of the season, raising more than $20,000 on Denver 7 Gives to replace the stolen gear. We definitely would not have been able to, to come up with this. And the adaptive community too. Companies Dyn Access and Enabling Technologies clearing their schedules to customize the gear in record time. And I honestly thought I'd be out for the whole season. So this is just such a huge bonus. You know, it's, it's still January. There's still a lot of ski season left. Um, I'm pretty stoked to be able to take those kiddos out and, and fly with them. And thanks to supporters in Colorado and around the world. We just can't thank you guys so enough. I mean, all of you. <laughs> Every, every single one of them. Mark and Jane are free to roam the mountains once again. We're back. Sloan Dickey. It's awesome. Denver 7.